So here you go guys, here's the Bikers Britain book, it's the second edition by um, Simon Weir. One of the first thing it says in the book is the B3135 is all about timing. And if it's off season, off peak season, when kids are back at school, etc. Then when you leave Cheddar on this yellow bit here, the B3135, that's the section. And it's only about three miles long. So this is the car park in Cheddar. This is where the route starts, what I'm going to do, because I've just ridden three hours. I did have a stop off on the way. The old prison, kitchen and cafe. So let's give that a go. Nice for a, recommend it for a nice coffee and you get a full English breakfast for about £10.50. And it's 40 miles, it's about an hour. So it's only a short run, taking me <laughs> three hours to get here. But the forecast is a, a nice day, the fork, it's 20 degrees now, and the sat nav's kicked in already. So there we go, this is where it starts from, Cheddar Cheese Co. The Toadstool Gift Shop. Cheddar George Cheese. On the Rocks Cocktail Bar. Mm, looks like a bit of a hip place at night. The Mouse Shoe. Fish and Chips. Mr Weir said try choose a time when it's out of season when all the kids are back at school it's the middle of September so hopefully it's not going to be too busy I, and I can ride through this gorge there's the uh, caves tour so straight away you can see that uh, you've got this rock face at the side Yeah, it is quite spectacular. Wow, that is a gorge. Nice little uh, switchback bends here, or sharp bends. It's jumped to a 60 mile an hour speed limit now, so it's interesting because the bends are still windy. <laughs> I won't be going 60 around these bends. Was it worth a three hour ride down to come and ride this uh, 40 mile loop? Well, I've only just done like two or three miles so far, but yeah, I would say so, just that first bit riding through the uh, gorge so this is the B3135 from Cheddar Plumbers Lane nice B road no traffic out of season enjoy still on the B3134 just caught up with some traffic 
worth considering whether just to pull over and let the traffic uh, move on so you can get a bit of the section of the road to yourself uh, yeah there's an articulated lorry there look so i am going to pull over so i can get uh, some of the road myself so i can get the road to myself On the A368 now. Very nice over there. So I'm now here in West Harp Tree pretty little church and I can see there's some bikers outside the cafe there on the corner so it's the first place you could stop for a coffee if you wanted to what's the bike outside the sinus Nice views on the A39. Going downhill now, but you can see quite a, quite a way in the distance. Right, guys, there's the cathedral in uh, Wales town centre. It's difficult to get through to the town centre on a motorbike or a vehicle. What I suggest you do is park in a car park on the periphery and then walk through the little jitters into the town centre to get a bike to eat. They grow some big strawberries here. <laughs> so from Wales on the A371 back to Cheddar, I've just pulled off at a pick your own strawberry farm and, and I'll turn the camera around in a second. You see the rolling fields of Somerset. Just thought I'd pull off and have a wee break. Maybe get a punnet of strawberries to put into the top box. Another bike I just pulled up. But I spotted the bike uh, cut out, Helmut City, Somerset. So this is me coming back down the gorge because when I got to Cheddar I actually went up the Cheddar Gorge again, turned around, came back down, descended because it's a decline on the way back down. Uh, so I did that twice in the day, so that's 12 miles altogether. And I likened it to a little bit like going to a theme park where you can queue up for an hour to get on a roller coaster and then you're only on a roller coaster for 60 seconds. Uh, so it's a bit like that uh, with the Cheddar Gorge because I travelled three hours to get there, three hours to get back home. Uh, so travelling for six hours and I was only going through that gorge for a, um, you know, for a short period of time. But I would recommend if you're in that area or passing through or you can detour to go through Cheddar Gorge, the B3135 and the B3134. It's a fantastic uh, bit of road. Uh, it's really, really good. Hopefully you enjoyed the video, guys. Uh, if you did, click the thumb button, subscribe if you're not already subscribed and the bell notification for future videos. Take care for now. Ride safe. See you soon. Bye-bye for now.